Kate displays a hint of a baby bump in black designer gown that she also wore while pregnant with Princess Charlotte as she attends a glittering Kensington Palace charity gala. Most mothers-to-be spend their pregnancy dressing their growing baby bump in ever-expanding maternity wear. But the Duchess of Cambridge proved that style doesn't have to suffer when you're expecting as she stepped out for a charity gala at Kensington Palace on Tuesday night. The pregnant royal, who is expecting her third child with Prince William in April, was the picture of elegance in a fitted floor-length black lace gown, which showed just a hint of a baby bump. Radiant Kate, who is known for recycling her favourite ensembles, also wore the £785 Diane von Fessenberg frock while she was pregnant with Princess Charlotte, now too, in 2014. Tonight the Duchess appeared in excellent spirits as she greeted guests at the event, which was held in honour of the Anna Freud National Centre for Children and Families. She appeared eager to keep the focus of her growing baby bump and was seen standing with her black clutch in front of her midriff. Kate wore her thick brunette locks and bouncy curls for the occasion and kept her makeup simple with just a touch of dark eyeshadow to enhance her features. The Duchess finished the ensemble with a pair of sparkling earrings and an eye-catching chunky bracelet. The Duchess met supporters and those who have been helped by the Anna Freud National Centre for Children and Families at a reception ahead of the event held to celebrate the charity's work. Torell Llewellyn, from West London, was among those who spoke with the Duchess. The 11-year-old, who is back in mainstream school after receiving support from the charity, said Kate told him, well done, having previously met him a few years ago. His father, Wayne Llewellyn, said, It makes a difference that the Duchess of Cambridge has taken an interest in this. It's brilliant. He added, There's a lot of children in London who could do with this kind of help. Journalist Kate Silverton, who compared the gala, praised the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince Harry for shining a light on mental health at precisely the right time. The mother of two said, the Heads Together campaign has done an enormous amount to raise awareness around mental health as a whole. She added, it has got people talking, it's just stigmatized it, so I think what they've done has been absolutely wonderful. Peter Fonagy, chief executive of the Anna Freud Center, said Kate is very interested in maternal mental health. He added, one of the things that we are interested in is intervening as early as possible in children's lives to improve their chances of good mental health throughout life. She's particularly concerned that mothers' mental health plays a major role in this and that we are able to support mothers to support their children. Kate has only made a handful of public appearances since Kensington Palace officially announced her pregnancy on September 4. The royal couple were forced to announce the pregnancy early because Kate had been struck down with the same severe morning sickness that she suffered while carrying George, four, and Charlotte, two, which forced her to miss several planned engagements. A statement last month revealed the baby is expected in April 2018.